Hi friends, welcome to my May haul. This is part one of my May haul. Um, I really, besides this stuff, I don't think I've ordered that much this month or last month. Um, so we'll see how huge this haul gets. Definitely this part is a huge part. Um, a big SPC order from, sorry for my slap on the desk, from their, uh, I think eight year anniversary, which is absolutely insane. Um, so yeah, so let's go ahead and get into it. I'm going to start off with Paper Shire first though, like, because that's the smallest thing. And then I have two kits. Um, I think they both have, like, foil and extras and everything. I didn't even realize this. Um, that I got from a uh, planner friend of mine who, she's not really into planning right now. Um, leggings, plans, Tanya, if you guys know her. And she was, um de-stashing stuff on her uh, Instagram so I just like I saw these and I saw the price and I was like I'll pick them up and I thought like I'd get multicolor or something if it wasn't like you know the, si the size kit I would need but this I even saw has foil so we'll see how that goes and then this um, also has stuff and it's a really old uh, caress press format I don't think I've ever used besides maybe one time used a format like this so we'll see how that goes also I might need some multicolor from SPC if I end up using that um, but yeah, let's go ahead and get into Paper Shire. So it has this, um, I think this is called an A5 journaling card. And it says, you are beautiful just the way you are. And it's like vanilla and Barry. And vanilla is crying, I guess, because Barry's giving her a flower. Or maybe she's laughing and crying. I don't know. And then the back of the card just says, thank you so much for choosing Paper Shire Stationery. Your orders help support our family and keep us living our dream. We hope this happy mail brightens your day. Have an amazing day and enjoy your goodies. So... That is so cute. Um, so yeah, let me go ahead and open my mail. Ugh. All right, so then we have the A6 um, one, which is the Pantone Leafy Meadow. I think they're doing this whole entire thing like the whole entire year for the A6 because I've gotten like two other ones with like the pink peonies. And um, the... How do you say? Um, the rose one, crimson roses or something like that. So I think they're like matching it to each month. So this is probably for March. Um, I'm gonna move the journal card out of the view. And let's zoom y'all in. So yeah. first things first, we have the Instagram freebie. You can choose either if you use the Instagram, what's it called? Um, code, then you get the Instagram freebie, like if you use Insta10 or something like that, and then if you say like you're in the Facebook group, just in the notes, and then you get the Facebook freebie. I don't really care to mark like social media, but I guess like if I wanted to mark like for my shop that I needed to make a post or something like that, and my, I don't really even have technically a shop planner. I mean, it's just kind of all over the place, but if I needed to mark that, then I could use these. Um, and then it has, th these have the same as the Facebook, like the top ones, so it's like a Okay, sorry about that. I did not realize my SD card cut me off because I had apparently reached the limit. But um, I don't know where it cut me off, but I feel like it was probably around here. So just once again, here are the Instagram freebie, the all orders freebie, and the 20 pound orders freebie. I love all the little treats. And then getting into my order. I thought these were supposed to be printed on glossy. This doesn't feel glossy to me. I'm very confused. Um, this was supposed to like mark like this was on their new paper, but I think they just ended up not doing that. But now they have just like the pink banner on top. I think for their new designs or something. I'm not sure. Um, so, anyways, okay. So we have the beauty tools here. This is like the little headband you use when you do your skincare, and then you have like an ice roller and like a brush i have one of those spin brushes and i have an ice roller that looks like that then you have the like um i forgot what they call these the steamer and then the like blackhead tool this is like a blackhead remover and then i'm not sure what this is maybe just like exfoliation this i'm not too sure what that is either maybe it's like lasers for like pimples or something like that um but yeah i have like a lot of the stuff i did want one of these steamer things but i just don't want to like 
keep buying more junk that like takes up room like I need it to actually be something I would use and I really wouldn't I don't do skincare that consistently sorry to be gross but um like I don't do like a whole routine consistently is what I mean then we have the car wash I don't really go and get car washes but I definitely just wanted these to have on hand um maybe when I have like a nicer newer car which we are my fiance and I are trying to do um, I would get my car washed and like clean it more and detail it more but like now my car is just like to get me to point A to point B and That's the same thing what a new car would be but you know obviously it's newer so you want to keep it shinier Then we have the condescending um, Vanilla and it's got its arms crossed and it says like ew and then the vanilla drinking wine I really just like the drinking wine a lot And then we have the couch potato which is just such a mood this is constantly me um more so like this or uh, sometimes like this when I take a nap after work. Then, <clears throat> sorry, excuse me, my chest, clear my chest. Um, it's the allergy season, but we have contact lenses here. I do wear contacts, not a lot right now. Like it just depends, like I am kind of really bad. I kind of put them in for like a month and then I don't ever take them out and then I take them out and my eyes are swollen and then I start all over again and I don't wear them for a few months and then I, yeah, don't do that. Don't be like me. Um, then we have um, the Don't Care. It's like a unicorn vanilla and then kind of like vanilla, like shaking his head no. And then vanilla sipping the tea. I love the tea. I love sipping the tea. Then we have emotional damage. Such a mood. I know the feeling, vanilla. Um, then we have the face palm vanillas. What is this on here? I don't think I put that on there. Oh. It's like a little dot. So whatever probably just from the printing and then this is the glasses one but these would be cute to mark like if you get new glasses and stuff like that um i haven't gotten a new pair of glasses recently because i got two the last time i got some and then we have the ignore vanillas that's me ignoring all my problems the hygiene products vanilla um then we have the nail care vanillas the vanilla is having a tantrum which is a vibe and then vanilla suspicious Oop. and then vanilla with wtf and just that is also a vibe spin now coffee wtf so that was my paper shire order i think i have one more on the way and i've been debating if i want to buy her like memo pads i do love post-it notes don't get me wrong i just I don't know. So then, let me show you the things from Caress Press via Tanya, aka Leggings Plans. And, um, yeah, then I'll see, like, what's this kit format. So, I just knew I loved this art, and I didn't think I saw Maggie bring it back yet. Or she had bought it to the shop before. Oh, this is matte, but it's okay. Um, so, I don't know which format this is. Let me see. Oh, it looks kind of small. Um, this might be just like the essentials, I think. So I might definitely, I'm definitely, ugh, I hate having to mix labels. Like maybe I'll make some on matte paper. I don't know if I have matte paper that's this texture. Like I would hate to have to mix glossy multicolor with matte, but it's whatever. It's more like a matte glossy, to be honest. Yeah, I think this is the essentials, but it's okay. I would definitely just pick up some, um, like multicolor labels from SPC. I just love this art so much and then it has the foil I think the foil is the same no matter what subscription or no actually it's not I don't think you get the bougie but I have gold bougie so it's not a big deal so we have the um the palms overlays then we have the um palms headers and bottom washi and then the scripts icons hole protectors and date numbers so yeah i definitely need some multicolor uh for this i probably won't use it this year just because i used it this year or last year already if i do i just won't use it for the same week because i just really don't have a lot of um uh, what's it called or if I don't know if Maggie ever ends up like reformatting I would definitely pull this in or something like that I don't know it's just really cute I just really wanted it so we'll see what size this one is um let me see this one's probably matte also yep it is matte paper um ah, there's the headers 
Looks like there's a lot in this one. So this is the July Mystery Jet Setter. Oh, this paper feels really thick. Is it two? No, it's just super thick. Um, oh, that's also kind of why I don't love matte. It's really thick to me compared to glossy. Then we have this page here. Little things, etc., etc. Um, those rounded labels. Bottom wash. Okay, so this is definitely not a full kit. I think this is probably like an essentials or something or whatever it used to be called. Then you have this fashion girl here, like planning where she wants to go. With these glitter headers. Um, the date dots. And then let the adventure begin. It's rose gold foil. And then these I probably wouldn't use. I could definitely destash. They're just slow travel countdowns, but they're like matte, so I would never really use them to mark anything. So that was my two caress press, like at once. One time they were mystery kits. They're both June and July mystery. I don't know which year this is. Probably like 2019, 2018. I think I remembered wanting this art. So yeah, definitely need to get some multicolor and try to match or either make it myself. I could try or just, well, actually it would probably, I could probably do it now. I used to, um, I've one time done that and I didn't use like my new color printer and my laser printer just doesn't get the same like picture color quality as like, it doesn't match perfectly, but these I could probably do with my new printer because of the vibrance and like my new color printer for my shop um, is like, it uses like eight different ink tanks. So <laughs> it gets really accurate, but um, so yeah. Oh, also, and then this also came from Tanya. It's just a once more with love, like munchkin, like mini sheet saying go to bed. All right, so um, last part of this haul bit is Scribble Prints Co. So let's go ahead and get into this first part. So this first part is the Stranger Things kit and I'm not going to open it. I mean you can see how it looks on the website. I hate just opening kits though. Like I prefer for them to stay in their cello until I'm ready to use them so I'm sorry. But um, if you want to see what it looks like or the reveal or whatever you can find her on YouTube and check out her site. So then on the back you get, you have like I think maybe this is 8, 10, 11, 13. I love that the, this scene is like by itself. I really didn't like when other shops were putting like characters in front of it. Um, it just feels like, you know, of that. And I feel like it'd be great on the inside of a, one of these double boxes or whatever. So um, I also really love the like, the Scoops Troops uh, Sunday and the Slurpee and then the Egos and the Police. I I just really loved um, the way that Scroll Prince Co. kind of made this whole entire kit come together. And I, I appreciated her interpretation the most um, of the art. So I went with this kit. And Shay is like freaking out. She's like scared that like red is not going to go really well with this. And I understand, but like I'm doing red with this. Sparkly red, more specifically, the star sparkly red. Um, I think she's going to do matte silver. But um, I think sparkly red will really make it like pop, like as a contrast, because there's a lot more like blue, black, and purple in and, and this kit. And I just definitely wanted to bring out like the red. And also, red just reminds me of Stranger Things in general because of the logo. So we're doing a sparkly red. And I do have full boxes from my shop that I'll be bringing in. Uh, quote boxes, I mean. So, um, so yeah. Then let me open this cello. This should just probably be like color of the week. Um, let's see, and some doodles, is it, I don't think it's color of the week, no, um, I must have not, oh, it is, okay, there we go, so, um, here we have the, I think this is the Kirsten freebie, you get a wax, books, target, weights, um, printer, soccer ball, Uno, um, what is this? Uh, YouTube laptop, sorry, blanked cinnamon rolls, HelloFresh, iced coffee, and then a sandwich. And then here we have this freebie. I like this one a lot. It's really pretty. Um, a foil sparkly hollow. I've been getting a lot of those. So cute. Then we have some burritos. Um, this is the sticker kit. I thought that would be cute to mark planning. And then we have the color of the week and this like 
hold on, let me show you the Stranger Things uh, doodles first. I love buying the add-on of the doodles from School of Prince Co. Um, that match like the kit that where you can bring them in. So let, let me put that with that so I don't forget that. Then we have the um, doodles here. So we have the sheet nine, which has the cruise, the rain boots, the rain umbrella, RV weights, workout shoes, Peloton, um, treadmill, purse, cloud purse, I mean, cloud keychain, cloud uh, wristlet, cloud planner, um, Play-Doh, what's it called? A uh, takeout bag, a mug, uh, hot coffee, shopping bag, shopping cart, more books, books, um, the little paw, food. I love how she did the dogs here, the dog stuff here. The dog, um, what's it called? Leash, and then music, and then you have sheet eight. I won't go through and show you every single, say like every single one what it is, but this one's more like babies, voting, church, gas, um, nail polish, snacks, phone, Lego, um, pencils, sweatsuits, doctors, so yeah. Um, then we have this sheet here with like, kind of like school stuff, TV, hair stuff, uh, games, uh, partying, um, I'm ambulance, Bible, shoes, sorry, I'm like blanking, candle, winter, some heart icons, some baking essentials, making stickers, etc. Um, game, mail, food, <laughs> coffee, uh, makeup, sports, there's no baseball one. I'm going to a baseball game next weekend, so that would be cool. Um, then we have this sheet here with the laptops, the Target bag, the Dymo, wax, all that. And then this sheet here. I love the cleaning one and especially the coffee pods. And then um, the sheet here with the TV and the Switch. Those are like my two, and then I like the credit cards and the house and all of that stuff. And then um, this is the Disney one. So that is the color of the week. I forgot what color this is called. I think she sometimes names them something and sometimes she doesn't. And then these were the doodles, which are just the burrito in the kit. So super cute. Then let's get into this ginormo order from SPC. So. Um, first we have the eight year bundle, not opening it on camera, like I'm sorry. Um, you guys can watch the reel if you want to, I just, I love stuff to stay together and I find it anno extremely annoying to open stuff that I already know what it looks like. So anyways, um, obsessed with this, I mean I saw it, like was in love, like totally my vibes, Y2K all the way, like, and I know people are like, this isn't really Y2K, this is interpretation of Y2K, okay, this is Y2K, post Y2K for me, as a, uh, kid born in 95, well, I'm not a kid anymore, and as an adult born in 1995, this is Y2K to me, like, Libby Lou, um, especially Skittles, and Freezies, and Slurpees, and Lizzie McGuire, and wanting, like, inflated, like, furniture like this was my y2k like if it was different for you great but this like love it so much and also the little planning area so cute oh my god like if i was like a planner girl in like 2000 like this would have been it um especially the little game boy advance i did have like this blackberry so that's why i'm like everybody's like this one was not like 2k okay whatever it was the oos whatever it was the aughts so anyways um i definitely did have this blackberry not as like a child but i had it when i was like 13 14 or 15 and i had like a like bejeweled case that i had got like i think in new york city at chinatown or something like that um so period and then um i picked up i don't know why i picked up another one of these um, but I did. Apparently, I think it's because I had planned to use the gold, use one of these with like a different Harry Potter kit, kind of Harry Potter vibes I have, but it's not exactly the Harry Potter kit from Scoop and Prince Co. So I picked up another one for that one for, to have two. So, because it was on sale. And then, um, I have here, this is the $300 freebie. I love these mats labels um yes i did i did kind of fall out um a little bit and then also i think they include this as well 
if you spend 300 let's not talk about it but anyways um i think you get them in all the colors so we get more gold i always love using the gold and then silver rose gold hollow and sparkly hollow and i'm so happy to have a full sheet because i ordered the mini ones too so obsessed i'm so excited mark all the important things then i picked up this not really for me because like if i had a wedding it would never be these vibes um i'm more like the like i like farmhouse type vibes this is very like girly and glam but i thought it'd be cute like if i have like friends or family that do indeed get up end up getting married or like another wedding i go to or something like that so i thought it'd be cute to mark like anybody else's wedding or something like that or just just have but it wouldn't mark like my wedding specifically just because the vibes aren't really mine um no tea no shade like i do love the pink don't get me wrong like i just could never see myself getting married like in a ballroom like i'm very like into like rustic natural like farmhouse vibes like i'm a horse girl i'm just kidding but anyways um then we have the disney cruise and i feel like this is the only way anyone could ever get me on a cruise because i actually have a fear of like being on a boat and I have a fear of the ocean. Um, so this is probably the only way I could ever go on a cruise. So I picked up the Magical Cruise. Um, and hopefully I get to go on one one day. Don't have any plans anytime soon. But I just loved the colors. And I just thought it was really cute. I haven't had any coffee yet. And it's... What time is it? Is my watch charged? It's 9.32. Then I picked up the... Um, Alo, um, Alo Mora? That is it. Aloha Mora. I'm sorry. I'm a Harry Potter novice. I've literally only read like two of the books, seen maybe like three of the movies. Anyways, um, picked up this kit. I already had the extras, so no extras in this. Um, but I love this double box scene. I don't know when I would use this. Maybe September, like back to Hogwarts. You know, I don't know. But um, super cute kit. Or maybe if I went to Universal, I might save that for when I go to whenever I go to Universal, because I could mark like the Wizarding World. Then I have Level Up. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna use this this year or what, since my fiance and my mom, uh, their birthday is the same day. But I could use it like split it or something like that. I don't know. I don't know, but I have the extras for this, and I thought this kit was really cute. And since it was on sale, I just went ahead and picked it up. Then we have Magique, and I also already have the extras for this. Um, so, yeah, so I'm super, like, excited. Uh, never been out of the United States, but definitely would use this to mark, like, Disneyland Paris. So that's what's definitely this is going to be held on to for. Just going to hoard it, you know, for a little while. But it's so cute. I love the colors. Then we have the um, sprinkle kit. Don't have any babies, but if I do have a daughter and even son, it'd be fine. Like, I really don't see a problem with this. But if I do have a daughter or son, whenever, eventually, doesn't really matter. Hashtag gender rules, norms don't really matter. But um, if I do, well, hopefully one day I do, but whenever that is, I could totally see myself having, like, their first birthday party being, like, this vibe and first, like, this theme or whatever, or even, like, a baby shower or something. Like, sweets. Everybody knows, like, I love sweets and stuff like that. So, um, sugar box stickers. I mean, sugar doll plans is a ring a bell. But anyways, um, so yeah, I am definitely hoarding this for that occasion, either a baby shower or a birthday party um, for whenever I have a child. So, um, not anytime soon. Maybe within four years. We'll see. <laughs> but then this is the To Infinity and Beyond kit. And I don't know when I'm going to use this. It's definitely like nostalgic vibes for me. I considered using this also to mark like my fiance and mom's birthday, but I don't know. I have no clue, but um, I just really wanted to pick up this kit because I hadn't gotten like the two other reformats and I love that this one has like pink in it and stuff like that and then it has doodles and stuff. I don't think I have the extras for this, but I don't really care. So, um, so yeah. All right. So that is all of the kits. Now let's go ahead and get into all the like foil icons, extras, etc. Um... Do, do, do. 
Okay, so um, these are the art, like uh, freebies or whatever. So this is a Sparkly Hollow Munchkins from Once More With Love. Then this is Sparkly Hollow um, Script Sampler, Lazy Day Bath, Barbecue, Play Outside, Date, Day Off, Meal Prep, Game Night, and Movie Night. And then I have, I think this is the Andrea freebie. Yep, and it has the candles, the ears, the um, tote bag, planner, Happy Meal, iMac, Dymos, Target, and then these remind her, I think, of her kids, the Super Mario, the Legos, the princess, and then the baby shark. Super cute. And then I have this freebie here, which is like the magic. And then it has some headers that can go on the sidebar if you have any magical spreads. And then let me show you the, I think this is the other freebie. Put a bow on it, um, some icons, and then this is Vince Co. Happy Mail. And I think that's it in terms of freebies if I do see one I'll point it out um so yeah so then I picked up some park scripts I think I only have them in gold silver and hollow um Hollywood Studios Epcot Magic Kingdom Animal Kingdom Disneyland and California Adventure so we have those and then um I picked up the movies the um Avengers movies, or it's called, I think, superhero movies, bucket list or whatever. So you have Black Widow, Age of Ultron, Ant-Man, Captain America, Spider-Man, The Incredible Hulk, um, Guardians of the Galaxy, Captain Marvel, Iron Man, Black Panther, Doctor Strange, Thor, The Avengers, Infinity War, and Endgame. It doesn't have every single one. Um, I am planning on making my own, like, bucket list of, like, movies, especially since Phase 4 is coming. So it, I'll have that in my shop, and I'll be able to make my own scripts for that but I wanted to get these just because I like how she does the icons next to them sometimes I love Captain Marvel then we have the matte label samplers I picked up um just like this one because these are what I would use mostly I don't really care for like the movie marquee ones and stuff like that um the like label v2 but um this is the sparkly hollow i got two of those i got two of the hollow i should be set for a while i got two of the silver and then two of the gold so it kind of makes a full thing like that awesome awesome sauce i should be good i should have like so many which i'm not mad about then i have the mother's day i think i'm using this kit for mother's day and I'm doing, I'm pretty sure, I know it kind of like says gold. Ugh, now I have regrets. I don't know. But at first I wanted to do hollow with this. I think I'm just going to keep it hollow. Maybe I could do like lavender hollow. Oh, I'm not even a lavender hollow like lover, but I don't know. It's screaming gold, but I think hollow could still work. Like it's screaming gold because of all the like other gold stuff in it. But to me at first when I saw this, I thought hollow. And I do have like a Lux hollow, so that's what I'm using for Mother's Day, you guys are seeing by the point. <laughs> Hopefully by the time this haul is up, I will have caught up in planning a little bit. Um, then I got some Disney quotes. So it says, if you can dream it, you can do it. It's kind of fun to do the impossible. That's the real trouble with the world. Too many people never grow up. Too many people grow up, I mean. <laughs> and the way to get started is to quit talking and begin doing. I love that quote. Um, so yeah, I have them in hollow, gold, and silver. And then I picked up these ones as well. I think I already, I don't know. I checked if I had some already. So then I have these, which is happiness is just a stroll down Main Street, USA. Mouse ears go with everything. The happiest place on earth. And then best day ever. Um, I have them in hollow, silver, and gold. And then... This says, talk Disney to me, feed me Mickey waffles and tell me I'm pretty, believe in the magic, I'm done adulting, let's go to Disney, and I have them in silver, hollow, and gold, so pretty. Then I picked up the movies, um, this is, I think this is supposed to be more like modern, no, it has Fantasia, I don't know how she does these, but we have Moana, Mulan, Zootopia, Frozen, Wreck-It Ralph. Tangled, Lilo and Stitch, Tarzan, Fantasia, The Hunchback of Notre Dame, um, Bolt, The Jungle Book, Hercules, and Big Hero 6. Um, of these, I have seen Moana, Mulan. I haven't seen the modern Mulan here. Let me show you gold. Um, 
seen Zootopia, absolutely hated it. Sorry to those that love it. My fiance loves it. I hate it. Um, Frozen, Wreck-It Ralph, Tangled, Lilo and Stitch, Tarzan. It's probably since been since I was a kid since I've seen Lilo and Stitch. Tarzan, I've seen Fantasia, I've seen as a child, Hunchback of Notre Dame. I've probably seen, I don't, I just probably didn't care. Both I've seen, um, Jungle Book. I'm probably seen it, I just don't remember it. Hercules I've seen more recently and I don't remember, I probably saw it as a kid, but I think I do, I, I think I also have seen it recently. And then Big Hero 6 I've never seen, so. Um, then we have this one here, which has Aladdin, Beauty and the Beast, Peter Pan, Pinocchio, Dumbo, The Princess and the Frog, Milan, The Little Mermaid, Sleeping Beauty, Bambi, Cinderella, Pocahontas, Snow White, Lady and the Tramp, The Lion King, and Alice in Wonderland. So I have them in hollow, silver, and gold. And I'll show silver. Um, not that you guys care. I've seen Aladdin, Beauty and the Beast, Peter Pan, Pinocchio, Dumbo, most likely. As a child, a long time ago, Princess and the Frog, Milan. Why is Milan twice? <laughs> I wonder if that's on purpose because of the like live action. Then The Little Mermaid, long time ago. Um, Sleeping Beauty, long time ago. Bambi, Cinderella, Pocahontas, No White. Yeah, I've seen a lot of these. And I used to be in Alice in Wonderland when I was a kid. Then we have the Pixar ones. So we have The Incredibles. I don't know where my other one went. I should have had, unless I forgot. <clears throat> I don't know, maybe it's somewhere, somewhere on my desk. But I should have hollow, unless I didn't pick it up. But anyways, we have The Incredibles, Coco, Cars, The Good Dinosaur, Inside Out, Monsters, Inc., Toy Story, Brave, Up, Wally, -E, Ratatouille, Finding Nemo, and A Bug's Life. I think this is all Pixar, I think. And then here are the icons so I got a lot of doodles we have a lot of doodles and I didn't need any more but I did it anyways so we have the hash browns from McDonald's we have the breakfast sandwiches the sims plum bums I think that's how you call them the laptops the chipotle bags the raisin canes bags okay guys let's talk for a minute I've never had raisin canes tell me why like, okay, the closest Raising Cane's, disclaimer, it's like two hours away. We are finally getting a Raising Cane's that's going to be like less than 10 minutes from my house. And I'm just so excited. I had to get Cane's bags to mark when I try them. Then we have the coffee cups. We have the um, book stacks, the weights, you know, for when I get back into working out consistently. The tennis shoes the YouTube TVs because a lot of time I mostly just watch YouTube on my TV and then we have the Monopoly money it's been a while since I played Monopoly the uh, dice to mark playing games the silhouettes to mark making stickers the nail polishes to mark um, going to the nail salon then the uh, cakes and then the cupcakes the presents to mark birthdays the heart um, mail for like happy mail or like dropping off mail at the post office, the YouTube heart play buttons, the like, um, I guess like a fast food meal, like chicken nuggets meal, and then the hamburger meal, and then I don't really get hamburger meal. Okay, oops, sorry. Um, my camera just cut out on me, but if you missed it, we got these two meals. Um, one nuggets, one hamburger, and I was like, I don't really even buy, like, burger meals at, like, fast food places. I'm more of a nuggets girl, but, so then we have the, like, mail, like, bin, like, to drop off mail. I don't really do that right now. Like, once I get big enough, I'm sure I will. And then we have the silhouettes, the dimos, um, the Uno cards, the um stickers i thought that'd be cute to mark making stickers the heart like love um things i don't really know how to say that <sighs> I'm, so tired. Uh, I'm sorry i need to drink my coffee soon then we have the hangers the dishwashers i hate doing dishes we have the laundry 
We have like the cleaning with the sponge and the buckets. Then we have the dishes. Refrigerator, Mark cleaning out the fridge. Um, the cleaning the toilet, Mark cleaning the toilet. Or cleaning the bathroom. Then we have more gifts. We have these TVs. We have the um, Happy Mails. The money, that would be cute to mark, like payday or something for my shop, or I don't know. Buying stuff, whatever. The credit cards, same purpose. And then um, the cars. So that was all the doodles from SBC that I picked up during her sale. And then here we have the add-ons that I had to pick up. So we have the... Um, Cruise fam, love this girl, love her outfit and her hair and everything, iconic. Then we have the Magical Cruise icons, I think you could get them, yep, I got them as the Disney and the, um, what's it called, how do you say, uh, normal. And then we have the fashion girls that go for the wedding, and then the icons for that, and then this is the $75 plus freebie. So that is everything for this portion of this haul. Um, more stuff will be coming. I know I have some orders, uh, but yeah, that is it for this portion, and I'll talk to you guys later. Love you guys. Bye. Or you'll see me in the next clip. Not really bye, but see you in a second. <laughs> Hi loves, welcome to, I believe this is the second part of this haul um, for May, for my collective planner haul. I have some goodies here to share with you guys. I have, I think, one, two, three, four, five orders of varying different things. So, super excited to get into it with y'all. Um, first up... I want to show you guys, I got some more Simply Gilded albums. Um, these are lavender ones. I tried to get the bundle and then it sold out. I can't remember why she was having a sale. Maybe it was for Easter or not. And then like literally a week later, she put albums like on sale specifically for like 30% off. I wish I kind of waited because I think these were only, I only got like 20% or 25%. It's not a huge deal, but... Um, so I got the large album, which the dimensions for the large one are 7.75 inches, uh, height, and the width is 6.5 inches, and, um, it's made from vegan leather with 20 clear 7 by 5 photo safe pages and a pocket inside. If you've never seen these before or had one I really suggest them um, I enjoy mine I don't know which purpose these will serve um, currently but we shall see um, the only thing, oh this one is double sided okay I feel like I had one that wasn't double sided or something also, I don't know what that dirt what this dirt is or whatever but it has this pocket you can put stuff I love the scallops and the little heart um, buttons and then this is the mini one open this up and I usually put my like Scrubber Prince Co um, icons in one of them or like my matte label samplers or um, mini icons or the doodles like the colorways from Scrubber Prince Co so this was the first thing to share with you guys was my Simply Gilded albums and the freebie was this like lunar um, celestial journaling card. It's kind of like a lavender hollow. It's hard to tell. Um, and then this freebie here with the heart icons, a full box, and some checklists, and then a little bow. So you have that. And then you have the bow like die cut freebie, and it's hollow and it looks tie dye like a sticker then moving on I have an order from stick with the plan co I love stick with the plan co and it had been a while since I'd ordered I think this is my first time ordering from her website since she moved off Etsy and I made a big order I think for Easter um 
So this is the journaling card. It said Squidge and Lottie. And I think this is like uh, about up. I've never seen up, so don't come for me. And then it just says, yay, your happy mail has arrived. And um, has like a thank you code you can use for 10% off my next order. Um, and say so check out our new website. So then we have some freebies here we have a lottie like drinking a drink a lottie doing like inhale exhale um a lottie with put myself first i love that and then a lottie i think it's hugging like a cloud but it kind of looks like a brain i'm not sure and then we have some squidge with a highlighter perfect for marking like studying squidge kind of cold and then squidge doing like go outside and then this says i did the thing so here we have some Feel the Love, Lottie and Squidge um, stickers. I love love, so don't need to have these just for Valentine's Day. Um, then we have Can't Sleep, which is me constantly. And then we have some swimming stickers. I don't really go swimming, but I thought I'd have those on deck. We have some Squidge Shops Online vibes. And then we have the Ikea trip Lotties, and I do need to make an Ikea trip soon. I need a new dresser and a organizer for my uh, makeup and my vanity. And then we have Squidge Loves Afternoon Tea. I'm not a huge tea person, but I do like this. And my mom, like one time she had like a, like there's a really fancy hotel. Sorry, I'm going to take a sip of water. There's a really fancy hotel in Washington, D.C. called the Mayflower. And one time when I was like 12 or 13, maybe 14, um, my mom was hosting like a baby shower for her boss um, there and uh, my mom was saying like, oh, it'd be cute if you could have like a bridal shower that's like tea and pastries and like maybe there or whatever. So I don't know. It could be the vibes. I don't know. Although but considering my wedding date, if I do have a wedding, even if I don't have a wedding, like that's probably going to be our like get married and elope date but um even if I do have a wedding I don't know like it's so close to, like fall I don't think that would like match the vibes like tea party feels very spring like a tea and like I mean it could it could work but you know getting married in the fall it definitely feels like I should have something more fall so then we have this Lottie who's like got period cramps and using like a hot water bottle which I used to use before electric heating um pads were a thing but um I could totally use this all the time especially this past not to TMI I hope but the last time I had my period was like I had the worst first day ever in like a really long time um I was like sick and nauseous and like throwing up so could definitely use that for that let me have some lotties on the treadmill i love the new like pink colorway i use a lot of kits with pink they have the lottie doing the weight training we have the lottie and the um blankets being cozy such a vibe lottie with some ice cream love that and then we have lottie and blankets we have lottie washing her hair we have Lottie um, drinking some wine, Lottie on a laptop, kind of studying because it looks like a composition notebook, um, but it could be just work. Then Lottie studying here, Lottie getting an A, plus Lottie organizing stickers. I thought that'd be, I mean, I organize stickers a lot, and also I make my own stickers, so that works. I could do that for that. Then, or doing orders, then we have Lottie jogging. Lottie angry, Lottie um, doing like sticker orders, which perfect for marking doing orders for my shop. We have Lottie with TVs, Lottie with headache. You can see I picked up a lot of the neutrals, <laughs> the new like neutral pink color. Lottie groceries, Lottie with drinks, Lottie um, on the phone, Lottie planning. Lottie um, drinking tea and reading a book, or it could be coffee. Lottie cooking. Lottie with coffee, or it could be tea. Lottie is celebrating a birthday. Lottie, again, celebrating a birthday with a balloon and a cupcake. And then Lottie laying on the couch on the computer, which I don't typically bring my computer on the couch unless my fiance wants me to like do something and I have like do something with him and I'm like trying to multitask. 
I kind of keep my computers completely like in our office so like my work and um, personal computer so unless I absolutely have to do something out there so anyways in the living room so oh actually so that was let's see um, three four five six I actually have I think six things to show you guys um, six orders I mean not things so then the next order is from paper chart oh, I love this journaling card I'm gonna zoom y'all out a bit so you can see it so we have the um, Hobonichi inside of like a little pouch with some pens and some highlighters of course and this is a highlighter and some washi tape and another pen and then this um, drink I'm like blanking that's like coffee cup uh, or travel coffee cup and then um, some notebooks I love this so much and then it just you know has the thank you and she hand letters your name um, so then we have in here I think this is I don't know what's in this one like why they're separate but I do like this like packaging um, there we go so we have the Pantone Lavender Rain I think this is for April I really love these they're so cute I'm gonna hold on to them and then I have my friend Cindy's freebie and I just send them to her so I'm going to go ahead and put that with her package of stuff that I send to her, plan to give to her, because she lives kind of closer to me now, so I could probably go see her. Um, then we have the All Orders Freebie and the £20 Orders Freebie. This is from the Planner Boss Collective sale. Paper Shard is the only shop I ordered from Planner Boss Collective. Um, and I picked up mostly just like the new samplers and some food doodles, because there wasn't anything else I really needed. I pretty much... Like, I used to routinely buy Once More With Love, like, every new release, so that way I wasn't, like, having as much, like, big orders to have to make with Once More With Love, and I've kind of been doing that with Paper Shy this year, so, um, we have some ramen packets, let me zoom you guys in, these are so cute, and I actually have been eating, like, instant ramen in these, like, kind of containers, and I eat one that's, like, called, like, hot and spicy, and it's really good, um, so we have that, and then we have the Cherry Blossom snacks, and it has, like, the Pocky, the Bun, the Kit Kats, the drinks and like milk chocolate or whatever this is so cute I wish I had this when I marked my like cherry blossom food mukbang with my fiance but you know I can have that for next time or just mark any other time I get like Japanese treats or whatever then we have some cherry blossom desserts oh this would have been so perfect um, but it has like tarts and strawberries and all types of stuff uh, cake and um, those little taiyaki uh, little fish things they're not real fish but the, like pastry fish um so yeah this would have been so perfect oh it's so cute oh, i wish i had it uh, when i did my cherry blossom mukbang with my fiance then we have some vanilla food samplers here this is new all oh, of these are so cute and just you could easily you know use these up i'm sure i have some of these as digitals and some of these as normal sheets but i think it's really cool um I don't always get the chance to like make myself stickers so I'll try to like whenever I use one of these I'll try to see like if I have them in digitals and make myself some more and if not then I'll try to find the sheet then we have the scene sampler this is more for my like functional planner I haven't showed you guys that I'm still trying to make it functional but this is more for that or either just like monthly um, highlights then we have the vanilla 2 sampler um, once again, I probably do have a lot of these stickers, but, you know, we love a good sampler, and I do have organization and working on my samplers. Then we have the school sampler, which is a vibe. I think I have the digital pack of this, but I still wanted to pick this up. Um, and I have some of these, like, sheets. Then we have the Shelf 2 sampler. It's so cute. I'm obsessed. Um, I think my favorite one is probably... I like the birthday, the baking, and like the little laptop. I also like the skincare fridge area. Um, this is a cute one too, like the little coffee shop. I mean, I love all of them, but those feel like the most me. Also this one here, like the little desk um, scene there. And then last but not least, I got a bullet journal um, doodle set with the cozy kitchen. This is also mostly for functional planning. I don't really bullet journal. I don't, I try, but it's not really that functional to me. So, but maybe I will eventually. I have a ton of bullet journals. 
um we'll see so yeah that was my paper shire order which obsessed i love it i also love the new pink um banner um on the top instead of the black so moving on i'm sorry it's kind of late okay so from Bubba Bear Studios, I just picked up some, I should have picked up two things of these dividers, but I didn't. Mm, I might have to go back and do that. But these are just like dividers that go in their um, album system. I'll show you. This is one of the albums. I put some like clear jelly on the um, inside of this, but it's just like dividers like this and you um, can separate out your section. So I wanna get one more cause I have one more of these and I forgot what I was gonna do. I might put my like bold icons in here. We shall see, I don't know. I also considered putting my scripts in here but then I figured out a different script system that I'm gonna do so I'm not gonna do that. And then I picked up the like four pocket, um, what are these, dividers? And these are, there's so much. I don't think I should need any more of these because these are a lot like I don't know how much is in here but it's just it feels like a lot and I I can't tell I can't remember these are not double-sided oh yeah they're not of course uh, or maybe one no they're not double-sided okay which is fine this should be more than enough so I forgot what I was gonna do I mean I was inspired by Abby lives well and I think I mentioned her in my um last haul when I showed these uh so yeah I'm gonna go watch what Abby you know shared how she did it and see if I'm gonna do something like that um so yeah so then I also got this freebie from Bubba Bear Studios and I also use my friend Shay's PR code um, I thought I used Shay's PR code I hope yes I did okay um, so this is Shay's freebie, which has the little ghosty, the little fox, tired cloud, which is how I feel right now, the heart, this is boo shit, and, or boo sheet, and coffee before everything, and then this pink little circle, and then if you want to use Shay's freebie, it's Shay 10, so then this has like, you know, the hello, trying to hope you come back and visit again, daily dose of giggles, when is it impossible to plant spring flowers, when you haven't bought any, <laughs> Oh my goodness, I'm not a huge pun person, but that is pretty good. So then we have some drive through doodle sampler, um, the money, crying over the money, don't give a bear, and then the bear on its phone, and then the bear having a stomach ache, which is how I felt when I was sick <laughs> from my period. So there is that. And then we have a new to me shop order. I can't remember what's their name i'm gonna look it up right now so that way you guys can know oh i don't forget but it's from etsy and um let me see this is from oh my god who is this from it doesn't tell me on my shop app even though it updates my like etsy orders into my shop app because it sees like the tracking number but let me see purchases and reviews Ooh, 19 of my favorites are on sale this is from color me magic co this is my first time ever ordering from them and i'm super excited um i saw some cute disney like vinyls and i just decided i wanted to pick up some especially in terms of like just setting up a planner or um i was just in a spendy mood like let's be honest so we i picked up this like print like journaling card sorry um of like the disney snacks so you got cotton candy a churro the mickey ice cream bar dole whip and like mickey um waffles this is so cute and then um here we have some washi and then we have some die cuts so ah. okay so this is the washi let me zoom you guys in and like try to get it to focus can you see it's like mickey and minnie i love mickey and minnie everything it reminds me of like me and my fiance and i buy us mickey and minnie stuff so it's mickey and minnie like kissing and then there's like a heart eh, come on 
it's like a heart and then they're like kissing um so yeah that is the washi super cute and then we have this magic come on this magic sorcerer mickey die cut i love sorcerer mickey everything so i had to pick this up and then we have mickey and minnie kissing here super cute and then minnie and mickey with some balloons so cute and then i picked up the daisy and minnie in the teacup and then i picked up the mickey and minnie and mickey's giving minnie a kiss on the cheek which is something my fiance does and then in pictures and stuff and then we have the happily ever after i love this one and it's mickey and minnie and it's like the little button you get at disney then i picked up the mickey ooh, has these like flakes um i picked up the mickey and minnie like on a bench and mickey's holding minnie's lower back and then we have mickey and minnie the 50th anniversary colorway and they're hugging each other and then i picked up the wanda and vision um die cut i love wandavision um and i feel so bad for them i feel so bad for wanda even though like i didn't like how she was behaving in dr strange and i didn't like the characterization i felt like it was redundant it's whatever so then so yeah that was my order from color me magic definitely gonna keep checking them out call me magic co sorry so check them out if you're interested and you love all things disney like i do and then last but not least i have an order from letters to apollo and we have scripts that say family vacay carnival theme park pool time i don't really go to the pool that much road trip hopefully my fiance and i will be getting a new car within the next three-ish months so um i'm gonna be going on road trips and then we have beach time which we don't really go to the beach often but here's hoping so that is all for this portion of this haul. Um, there will be more. There's more orders coming, obviously. I'm going to buy more stuff. Uh, don't worry. So um, until, you know, the next portion, which will be like less than 30 seconds for you. But until the next portion, I'll talk to you guys next time. Hi, loves. Welcome back to another section of a haul for my May Collective Planner Haul. Um, this is... A lot of fun stuff i forgot to show you guys this stuff last time so this isn't really planner but like every girl in the planner community well not every girl but a lot of people in the planner community love stony clover um as do i so i was like really skeptical 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 about getting on like the stony clover kick um so i'll go ahead and show you guys this stuff first but um i had gotten their stuff from target during the target um stony clover collab and i fell in love with it and i wanted to get my first official one and like an influencer was offering like a 24 hour like discount code and i saw see amy draw um mention it and mention that code because see amy draw also ordered with that code from that influencer and they usually don't give PR codes they're like usually you get like a welcome 10 like a 10 percent but not anything like more so I just went ahead and did it and I got um a small pouch and I got the medium patches with Mickey and Minnie and they're so cute um if, and I have this inside <laughs> from uh no white space stickers the planner holder annual planner holder um Disney thing but um I don't know why I put that in there, but I need probably just clean off my desk because I'm doing a lot of stuff preparing for my magical release. So yeah, so um, this is obviously um, super cute. I got it in like, I think this is like the Flamingo or maybe it's called Bubblegum. I'm not sure. I'm definitely ready to order another. And at first I was going to order everything like Noir, but I might order some stuff in the new like Cotton Candy or like the, it's not probably new. It's probably just something that got bought back. Um, but yeah, I am obsessed with this. I love this so much. Um, so this is my little small pouch. And then I got um, this size pouch. I forgot what size this is called. Um, this is this is, this is is a small pouch, but I'm confused. Um, but anyways, I got this and I got MRS and then the Mickey P sign with his hands, with his gloved hands. Or it could be Minnie Mouse. Um, she also has gloved hands. Uh, but yeah, I got this. And I'm not married yet, but I was trying not to like buy like monogram stuff and um other stuff with like my old initials and I thought this was just nice like I especially want to have like a bachelorette at Disney 
because it looks like inside. Um, I definitely want to have my bachelorette at Disney and I'm starting to kind of like, because like the date I chose, well, my, the date my fiance and I chose is like a year and a half away officially now. So I feel like I have to really start being like seriously committed to planning a wedding if we want to have a wedding next year. So um, we're getting towards that. We'll see. I might document some of that on my channel. Um, with y'all but yeah that's my two stony clover things and i'm ready to like go make another order but we gotta pace ourselves because those things are not cheap um so yeah so then here on the top we have some simply gilded washi um simply gilded had i think like a birthday sale this shipped super fast i didn't get a lot i just got like four pieces of washi and then um because i had already ordered an album and that was hopefully i think in this in this haul um that i just showed on like a few a few minutes before this um but this is the sterling card it says good morning and it's like a bear latte with silver foil and then um we have the uh sampler freebie and it has like a sushi free a uh, quote not a freebie not a quote box what is the word um a sushi full box and then some heart icons. I might actually keep on to hold on to this one because it has like a blush color and I could definitely use this on little things, these icons. Um, I probably wouldn't use these but I, and probably not that but I would definitely hold on to those. Um, then we have these like money honey decals. They kind of have some like defects uh, like down there not to be nitpicky. Um, I wouldn't see why I would use these, so I'm definitely not keeping them. They're definitely gonna go in like a de-sash or um, might toss them. Um, then we ha I got the two latte, I think there were more other colors, but I got these two specifically, pink and brown, like these little latte washies with the bow, and then it has like a spoon. And so the brown has like a gold, and then the pink has like a rose gold. Then I picked up, I think this also came in like a mint color, but I picked up the sushi washi. I love sushi so much. I don't really typically eat sashimi, but I think the doodles are cute nonetheless. Um, and then I got the birthday cake um, washi. Love birthday cakes, love cake, love all of that, love birthdays. Um, so yeah, and then we have this tie-dye. Um, I think I might have gotten another one of these already, but a tie-dye Simply Gilded Bow with Hollow. So yeah, that was that. Let me move my SPC out of the way so I can show you guys my Honey Bee Shop. I think it was just showing their address, which is fine. I think they have a public store, so um, I don't think it was showing my address. So anyways, um, we have some Honey Bee Shop stuff to show you guys so this says packed with lots of love and honey and let me try to delicately oh and I made a hole okay whatever um open this but um I picked up um I don't understand okay so why are some of these clear mm. okay I don't know what's the thing okay so I picked up this decal it's a small biz owner because you know I'm a small biz owner it's so cute I don't know where I want to put it yet um maybe on my laptop or something I don't know I don't know if I have room for that I have to change my laptop cover this says living my best life one page at a time I guess it's like supposed to be about reading I haven't had any time to read but I want to get back into it um then this is their um what's it called business card and it says planner babe and then on the back it has all their socials like their website the babe box instagram facebook tiktok and email and then we have some adhesive pockets i wanted to pick these up for obviously i have like a magical cloud but i also do like a lot of disney like setups and stuff like that and stuff so i wanted to pick that up i think I don't know if they were having a sale. I think I definitely just wanted to pick it up to be able to showcase some stuff and also for my magical cloud. So here's some of the pockets. You have a small clear one. I don't know what you could fit in this. Maybe like a like a task card. I think a task card's like this size. So something like that. I'm not sure. And then I got the one that says adult sticker collector and it's like sparkly hollow. And then another blank scallop one. 
and then this one has like sparkles and it's the biggest one so super cute and then i also picked up the disney one along with some disney papers <clears throat> um the disney adhesive pocket so we have a small one and it looks like this and it's hollow and then we have this one and it's also hollow um this one's messed up that's fine it's definitely off cut i don't know i don't know if i'm gonna contact them about that because i don't like how that looks and it's also this is off so i don't know and then last but not least we have this one which has like it's a small world the castle mickey bar what mickey waffles dole whip cinderella a slipper a phone a polaroid camera poison apple ears mini ears um the gi joe uh i forgot the alice in wonderland guy's hat peter pan a mask of two ears teacup from uh beauty and the beast sorry if you heard my heard my air kick on a frog i think from princess and the frog uh the um magic lamp i think <laughs> from uh Aladdin, Swisher Mickey, Aurora's uh, crown, Mickey Heart, um, I think this is Eeyore, Andy, um, Winnie the Pooh, Pirates of the Caribbean, <gasps> balloons, the fork from Ariel as well as the shell, and then this is, I'm pretty sure it's from Tangled, and then this is from The Lion King, so super cute, and it also has little hollow foil bits, so love that i'm just a little disappointed by like that other one that i got that's not the way it should be so then i picked up an album i have so many albums like why do i keep buying them um but i picked up this one i don't know andrea she she may do it so she said like this one had like more pockets or something so and i also like that it has this little jelly slot area so i don't know what's my plan for this yet but i mean eventually i imagine i could you know fit enough doodles or something in here maybe i'll put like my um like my foiled icons or something whenever i get to that in there i don't know we will see so pick that up and it's like the mint color and then here last but not least from the honeybee shop i picked up some dashboards Alright, I mean not dashboards, like papers, paper packs. So we have the black and white Mickey heads. And then on this side you have this pattern of like the castle, the Mickey head, and then the fireworks. Then same thing here. Then we have some bows. And on this side we have like planner stuff with Mickey theme. <laughs> Sorry. I have hiccups. Oh my goodness. If I continue, I will try to take a sip of water. Same thing here. So you get two of those. Then you have this one here, which is yellow and white. And then you flip it over and have this here of like that pattern that was on the um, vinyl pocket. And then, oh, come on, does it want to separate? So then you have same thing here, another one. And then you get one um, acetate, super cute. And then you get one vellum with this pattern. So cute. I love it. Can't wait to set up my magical cloud. Oh, I'm sorry for yawning. I haven't had any coffee yet and I've been up since like 8.30. So now really quickly, I'm going to show you an Aura Stell order. This wasn't really for me to plan, but I might consider it because I really... I haven't been using my Hobo A6, but I did enjoy using that size, so I might use this, but it's more so, more so for, like, my shop. Um, not for shop planning, but for, like, product pictures and stuff like that. So I picked up an A6 um, cloud from Orestel in the color Camellia, I think. I have a B6 Airy also in this color. Um, I had hoped, I don't know if they have the A6 in the rose quartz, but you can see i love the color um it's close enough to rose quartz rose quartz is a little bit more pinky but it's whatever i do like this blush pink color so um let me take that 
foam walked out but yeah so it has only just the strings on the back for like the tan thing and then have pens pen spots i didn't even know it had all this i don't think i paid attention to if my b6 cloud has that but i do have my b6 cloud right next to me so let's check oh yeah it definitely does i just never noticed so this is my b6 cloud let me show you the color comparison the texture comparison and the size comparison so a6 b6 you know we love a six um so there you go there's the comparison this one's obviously chunkier it's a b6 um yeah it does have these this is like that pebble texture i know a lot of people prefer the pebble texture i don't care one way or another this also has the strap on the front and the back you can see my charms that i have down here um and i also have a little like mild liner i think fine liner or whatever stud how do you say that stud color liner pen whatever um so yeah uh this is supposed to be my shop planner i don't really plan in it though i mostly just like write stuff down in a notebook but i do want to have a shop planner eventually um i just feel like i'm not really like i don't know i need to figure out like a way that works for me because uh, i don't want to like weekly plan for my shop planner because i don't need to do stuff weekly constantly so anyways um so yeah so this is the a6 i think the rings are pretty chunky pretty big um but yeah i really do love this and it has like this pocket and this pocket and i think is that the main no it's not the main difference i don't know why oh wait actually okay so this is what is a little different about these pockets so this has like this and this is like built like this so um and also i have this it needs to be cleaned but i have this um what's it called a dashboard um but yeah so i really like both of them i mean i I, I'm a perpetual like personal planner changer so um, it's whatever so yeah uh, I definitely wanted to have this just to also make sure that like when I make ASIC dashboards like, they fit fine so I'm definitely gonna buy some inserts online to just set it up and like make mock stuff and whatnot but I do love this texture though I will say that I kind of like the smoother texture compared to like the large pebble or like I would prefer like maybe a small pebble but um, come on don't bend um, but yeah, I really do love this, and I got on sale too, so during, I don't remember what sale it was, but it was like a, a flash sale or something, I don't know, but I really love this, and it's so pretty, so yeah, so then, last but not least, we have some SPC mail, and for the kits, we have Boardwalk, um, I'm zooming you guys in, we have Boardwalk, I'm not gonna go through it, because I like for them to stay in their cellos, but um i don't know what i'm thinking of using this kit maybe the week of memorial day i'm not sure yet um then we have the love will win actually i think i might use this the week of memorial day because like it's technically like going into june and that way i can kick off pride month that way because usually i always end up having to wait until the end and then i also picked up hello summer i like how you know i have a lot of pu purple color schemes going on here so i'm definitely going to try to do that i have like a lot of purple in my planner this year um so yeah i have the hello summer as well um and i do have a juneteenth kit coming from pink diamond planner co um it just shipped last night while i was like asleep <laughs> so yeah so then let me open this cello here with some doodles and stuff oh wow okay um i don't know what's the freebie or what okay so we have this freebie here which is just the summer freebie and this like green bright green color um almost kind of lime but you have a flamingo floaty a little drink a sandcastle a candle um a seashell books nail polish flip-flops a laptop a bikini boat and then like a flamingo thing with a drink and then we have this final here i feel like i have this one but i'm not sure um but i think this is for like um uh, pride month um and for uh, juneteenth and stuff like that i remember this came out around juneteenth um so yeah for the month of june not pride month <laughs> but anyways then we have this and i do remember having this last year um i don't remember if i had ordered who i had ordered it from SPC or Punsbar with Love. Now I'm confused. But um, it's got the different uh, 
flags like in the hearts uh, with the munchkins so they're so cute and then um have this little sticker i think like how they put it on the outside of your yeah on the outside of your packaging super cute um and then a little pocket and then here we have um i picked up some of the ice cream scoops and then i picked up the um rainbow what's it called hold on the rainbow doodles so i picked up the i just did the buy all so i got the sheet 10 sheet 9 sheet 8 sheet 7 sheet 6 5 i feel like this will be so perfect for summer for 3 two and one so I did that and then do this we have um we have the uh, matching doodles for the kits we have love is love doodles we have hello summer doodles i picked up the hello summer extra colorway then we have boardwalk and then i picked up the fashion people for boardwalk and then this is the $75 freebie. I love this pink. And then last but not least, I picked up the um, fashion add-on freebie for Love is Love Fam 2. So that is it for this portion of the haul. I hope you guys enjoy watching this portion. And there will be probably, hopefully, at least one more other portion. We'll see. Um, but yeah, that's it for this portion. I'll talk to you guys in the next portion. Hi loves, it has been a very long time, but I am doing the last part of this May haul. I considered adding some stuff that came in June that was technically ordered in May that I have because it's currently June 13th, but I'm just going to do what was delivered in the month of May as I usually do. Um, so I have some really bad anxiety right now and I thought at least filming a haul and putting away happy mail like where it belongs because I kind of put it in random parts of my desk um, <laughs> uh, whenever I um, need to film and I don't want to put it away yet so we're gonna go ahead and just share this haul and then I'll also film the next clip starting the next month off and I have a lot of happy mail so that is at least something that makes me a little happy um, but I've just had really bad anxiety recently um, feeling really depressed so not to dwell and harp on that this will be the last part of the May haul and um, I can't wait to show you guys everything so first up we have a paper shire order and we have this ginormous I think this is an A5 size journaling card with some rosé and it looks like sparkling like strawberry either wine or juice and um, then you have a strawberry like shortcake I love strawberry shortcake and you have these little strawberry cupcakes another slice of cake it looks like shortbread cake and then this is the slice after it's been cut it's like a little picnic of the bear and the vanilla and then a latte and i believe this might be honey or jam and it's just a very cute scene and then on the back is just a thank you um where zinni the owner of papershire hand letters your name such a cute touch and i do love holding on to these journaling cards so i will be holding on to that then I picked up some stationery. I didn't realize this this much. I'm so excited. I love stationery. These don't appear to be sticky. They're just memos, but that's fine. And I think this one is also a memo, so that's fine as well. And then this one as well is a memo book. So really cool. And I have one other memo. This paper is so cute. I don't want to get rid of it. I just love it so much. I love Paper Shire so much. Anyways, um, so this is the big, let me zoom y'all in and move this out of the way. This is the big, like, must-do uh, memo list. I do like doing these, especially to, like, pop in my planner. I don't really use, like, an everyday planner. It kind of varies on like what I feel like playing in sometimes I use my B6 Aerie from Oracell sometimes I use my A6 Hobo sometimes I 
I won't say sometimes I use my A5 hobo, but today I was playing in it because I wanted to play with stickers. Um, so there's that. So we have this must do like checklist. And then I could also use it for work, shop stuff, whatever. Then we have um, this one here. It's so cute and they're so thick. And then, so you get a lot. And then you have this one here with date and then stuff in the AM and the PM. I think they still had more stuff on their site, but by the time this is up, like you guys missed the Papershire birthday sale. I believe Papershire shares like the same birth month with um, Zinni. I think she shares the same birth month like of June. I think with her partner, I think they're married now, so I think her husband, um, I could say partner too, it doesn't matter, and I think her children as well. I'm not 100% sure though. So this is the other memo pad, and then um, this is the other one. It's just so cute. I love it so much. I wish I could be like this minimalistic, but I'm not. I'm a maximalist. So anyways, those are my memo pads that I picked up and I just ordered more paper shire because of their new releases and birthday sales. So that is exciting. And then we have this sheet here and I, I hadn't gone through like my most recent order that I had this which is this so I didn't know everything I had so I had to try to just like look at my shop app and like at my orders and see what I had so here we have the vanilla sunbathing I've been kind of like I don't typically like going to like the pool or sunbathing or anything like that but I think it'd be like a nice like escape so I've been kind of wanting to do that um and maybe even go to the water park this summer and I've can I've started to make plans about going to the beach with my fiance and mom and hopefully my dog um so yeah then we have vanilla i'm sorry i'm tired i'm so sorry for my aunt but this is vanilla soda and i love soda so i thought this was so cute um there are like sometimes there's like dessert candy soda pop shops so could be for that or just marking getting a soda or something like that and I do sometimes just get a McDonald's coke it's just the best then we have vanilla with ice cream this is just so cute I love it so much I just I love ice cream I think I might have accidentally picked these up I'm not 100% sure oh well if I did because it does get hot in the summertime and I probably will mark it um but yeah, this is vanilla, vanilla heat wave. I don't really like summer like that, which is why I'm not a huge, like, let's go to the pool, let's go do this. I mean, the pool does cool you down, but, like, I don't have my own personal pool. If I had my own personal pool, I'd probably feel different, so. And then this is vanilla flat pack furniture, which is essentially vanilla, like, buying furniture and, like, assembling it from Ikea. And I think I also picked up this as well, but hey it is what it is so that those are the stickers I ordered and then let me show you the tiered freebies seems to be in this like new like um glossy oop it rips this new glossy envelope the material looks different it's much more like crinkly so then here we have this Pantone apricot prairie they're doing like these pantone journaling cards the a6 size um with like the flowers i think it's really pretty i do love this color even though i'm not a huge orange and yellow person i just definitely think this is a really cute card and then we have the instagram freebie i'm glad now the facebook and the instagram are the same so pretty much you just um you can either say mention the facebook group and get the freebie or if you do the instagram code you still get the freebie with instagram doodles which i don't really care to mark facebook or instagram but i will use this for like shop content planning um social media planning for my shop but in my memory planner i don't care for it so then you have this vanilla i think i can't tell if they're like sipping juice or coffee or what that is it is really cute though they have a vanilla that goes fishing i've never gone fishing my grandma's allergic to fish so probably wouldn't do that oh i'm sorry for my own then i think this is a vanilla eating onion rings which is so me if it's not onion rings it's donuts but i could totally use it for onion rings i love onion rings and then this is vanilla on like a hot air balloon i just thought it'd be cute probably be cute for something for summer 
there's this little shark dolphin no, actually I think it's a whale whale dolphin scene on like a beach then vanilla with cheese I love cheese vanilla with bacon I also love bacon and then um, or it might be jerky and then a coin and then you get the all orders I love these little sheets for functional planning and then this is the 20 pound order freebie so that is my paper shire order then let's go ahead and do let's do one more with love since we're on character stickers and then we'll repeat down with planner co and then to go prince co so this was a i think this was a mild one more with love order for me i can't remember she really hasn't been coming out with that many new releases so i haven't been like ordering that much but um let's see here we have this freebie. May you feel only the best kind of emotions this month. I love this. I would totally be able to use this. Especially this one. And this one and this one and this one. All of it pretty much. I've been kind of feeling these emotions. So I feel like Marg. And then we have... Well, it's a little bit decent. Let me take my invoice before you guys see my address. So here is the journaling card and it says if today was heavy write it down and let it go i do want to like i was journaling for a while for a while i mean like a few days but that was a few months ago and i want to get back into it um and like de-stressing so i think this is a super cute card um and then it said i designed this card on a particular diff particularly difficult day I woke up feeling off and knew it was just one of those days where my brain wasn't isn't on my side but that's okay that's kind of how i've been feeling today um i wrote about it on my journal spent time with people i care about ate some yummy snacks and just took care of me on days that are harder than others pick up your tools your planners your stickers your pens it's kind of what i'm doing also today um your washi write down how you feel and leave those feelings with your pages so that you can move on to growing healing and loving yourself some things are best left in black and white love mark and then i don't really keep up with the facebook group but i think I've seen some posts I don't have like social media has been kind of giving me really bad anxiety um just because of like the state of the world so I mean I and I'm not spending like any less time on it but like stuff like Facebook and Instagram I definitely feel like I am I don't think I've kind of cut down on like TikTok or anything like that but I'm gonna try mm. I'm so sorry for my aunts but anyways um Facebook is like an app I don't really even want I mostly keep it for the sake of like my shop um but I typically don't have notifications on I also keep it for the sake of like whenever I do randomly check it if there's a whack shop having a sale having a restock having whatever I see it there but I don't really want Facebook <laughs> so anyways getting into the order we have the worry munchkins I think she went back to like a different paper or printer because these feel like not the same as I had seen. They're not as like shiny and glossy, which is fine. I don't care. This is budgeting. This is paperclip 2.0. This is meal prep. I don't really meal prep, but I thought these could work for like cooking dinner. Then we have hairstyling. I don't really blow dry my hair, but it doesn't matter i mean i do blow dry it with my dyson air wrap then we have so cute and then this is fine which i feel that and then we have spring flowers which is so cute and i've been getting flowers like here and there for a while during the spring i i think i haven't planned those yet so i could definitely use that to mark that um we have be cool and my feelings have completely felt this pool floaties they're so cute life is a beach like i said hopefully going to the beach soon and then summer doodles super cute so yeah then that was it for once more with love so let's show you guys pink diamond planner co it's been a while since i ordered pink diamond planner co but i picked up this ethereal monthly kit and I picked up this Juneteenth kit um can't, I think Juneteenth Juneteenth is this week today is Monday so that would make it Sunday I think let me see yeah 
yeah that would make it on sunday so i'm contemplating using this this current week that i'm filming this i'm not sure 100 percent yet but i got the new colors and the new format um i love the ben and jerry's and the watermelon all of it pretty much and then the little parade slash protest or march um the shirt uh black history um yeah so i really like this one i also liked the one last year but i like these colors more um so you have and also it's in the newer format this one so you have this sheet it's been a while since i've had a pink diamond planner co kit um i only like it's not really a huge gripe i just don't really care for these like dashed lines but it is what it is um i love that the glitter headers come in the kit and i do like this glitter it's kind of like really chunky and then you have that's 10 boxes in total they have this page here the little things could probably do without the headers but yolo you have this um pattern box page here and then the bottom washi is already split which is awesome and then um the 1619 project is something my mom really enjoys and i don't remember if my mom's read becoming i haven't read either one of those but um bottom washi is so cute i just really love the colors and then here is shay's freebie i use my friend shay um she's a pr girl for pink diamond planner co um so it comes with these headers TV time, coffee run, sleepy AF, lazy day. I can't tell if this is man. I don't think it is manufactured foil. Um, it feels like my paper. So manufactured foil feels a little bit different, but it doesn't matter to me. I know that some of her stuff is manufactured. That's why I was wondering. So then we have Juneteenth, uh, the 15 millimeter solid washi. We have these boxes, and then we have this. Um, fashion girl so that is the juneteenth kit that tall tall box fashion girl um so that's the juneteenth kit from pink diamond planner co then i picked up this ethereal monthly and um i didn't get a chance to use this kit but as a weekly and i probably wouldn't have wanted to but i do think it'd be really pretty for like march my like anniversary month um i just think it has those good elements i'm like one spread away with being done with March, so I'm gonna be using this soon whenever I can film and catch up, which is hopefully soon. I've been in one summer class and it's been really tiring. It's a five week class and it's almost done, so I will be hopefully catching up soon. Um, so yeah, then we have this page here of the like boxes. And then these fancy labels. I wish like her fancy labels would like had the glitter stroke in like all of the kits. Like the ones that had the dash lines. Then we have this page here. I hope this fits. I don't think this is one and a half by one and a half because that would be um, Caress Press. I picked up, I mean not Caress Press, uh, SPC's version. I picked up Caress Press version because that's the inserts I use. So then we have this cute little um, sidebar. For the monthly and then it also comes with the checklist and then some deco so super cute i hope um she does more monthlies and they're there once she brings her um i placed another order from her and it did ship already and then i'm also waiting on her to bring her like june mystery i think to shop i'm gonna be hoarding just like a bunch of summer kits for next year just because i'm not a huge summer fan and i don't always like know what like art's gonna be coming so anyways, last but not least is Scoba Prince Co. And we have um, Mystery, which I'll go ahead and do that first. And then we have Orchard and some foil and extras. So let's do Mystery first. And you should have hopefully seen it already by now. So hopefully it will be no spoiler to you at this point. This, I love this mystery kit so much. Usually, you guys know I don't even like to open kits on camera, but we have to, like, give props for this. So, I really love the, um, colors for sure and, like, the aesthetic. It's very Sugarbox stickers, very on brand for me. 
considering just hoarding this until October, the week of my shop anniversary, which hopefully I'll be able to do something really big because I didn't get to do anything last year for like one year, so maybe it'd be like a one, two, I don't know. I can't promise too much because some stuff is going on in my personal life. Um, in October, I'm hoping to visit my soon-to-be father-in-law for his 70th birthday and um, might be getting married this year, so um, we shall see. Can't make any promises. Um, so then you have this tall box here, which I love. I also love that SBC has been doing the tall boxes on this page, um, as long as they're cute, which this one is, and I love these colors. They're just so sorbet, like, ugh, I love it. Then, these are like some of my favorite colors. Then you have the glitter headers, all of this. These rounded labels, icons, this is an older format. Um, love this, love these colors. Love these pattern ones, especially the sprinkled one. These sprinkles here, and this fashion girl is so cute. I love this double box scene with the ice cream. It reminds me of Cold Stone. Also reminds me of like those fancy gelato places. I feel like I've spoken ad nauseum. If you're new here though, you probably don't know. When I was in high school, I used to work at a gelato shop um, and our gelato was like nothing like this. Um, we actually kept it covered so that way it wouldn't like, the air wouldn't cause it to do all this stuff. And so it would like, we would keep it in like these stainless steel, con uh, cylinder containers and I would like cut my fingers on them all the time because they're stainless steel and they have these sharp round edges so yeah but these are really pretty colors once again I love this girl here I mean I love all the girls and I love this scene here as well I could honestly use this for like my birthday or something like that this little neon sign 15 milliliter ombre washi I love how SBC did that and then this is the extra boxes and then it came with gold foil and confetti um i think gold fits really well with this i might possibly consider making some like ice cream overlays to go with this so who knows we'll see like quote, quote boxes or something we shall see so that is um the June 2022 mystery from Scribble Prince Co. And then, um, last but not least, we have my order from Scribble Prince Co., which has this orchard kit. Let's go ahead and get into it. Might as well just open it on camera. And I'll put it away off camera. <laughs> so we have this double box scene. When I'm when I saw this, I was so excited. I'm I'm a fall girl through and through. Born in the fall. Love fall. It's my favorite time of like the year besides Christmas. Um, and I almost like it more than Christmas because it's not that cold. So, um, and honestly, also my birthday, Halloween, da, 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 Thanksgiving. So anyways, um, had to pick up this kit. Don't know when I'll be using it. It feels very September-ish. Like whenever you go apple picking, I could see myself using this. So um, yeah, I really love this girl. Love the little muffins. I think they're like chocolate chip muffins or chocolate chunk the girl picking apples the apple pie i love all the food in it and then we have this um page here and then we have this page here as well with like a flat lay with these apples i've definitely made like chocolate apples not caramel i don't like caramel apples and then you know some baked goods some apple cider donuts an outfit flat lay a denim skirt i love wearing denim skirts in the fall and then these colors are very just on brand for fall super pretty and then I have this page here obviously this is a newer format um, so we have I love this red plaid and I also love this like crosshair plaid as well and this blue like yarn pattern this one's cute as, as well as this one is cute as well <laughs> and then we have the little trunk which is hopefully gonna be me and my fiance when we get our new car. And then the washi's already split, so it's perfect. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited for this. Super excited for the fall. I did pick up, um, and I'll put them with the kit, the Orchard Doodles in the colorway. And then I also picked up in this order 
some of SPC's newer um, mini icons. So I have them in sparkly hollow, hollow, silver, and gold. And I'm going to show you in gold and try to guess everything. This looks like a kettlebell, laundry. They're kind of really detailed for being so small. I kind of like the ones more with loved ones a little bit more. I don't think Mark drew these. Um, but, I mean, these are so cute, and I'll definitely still use them, but they're so detailed, it's really hard to, like, get all the detail that are so tiny. Um, so yeah. And then I got the food ones, and sparkly hollow. There's two food ones. Um, hollow silver and gold and then same thing for sparkly hollow the food ones aren't that detailed so i think that should work fine um hollow silver and gold it's definitely kind of my goal to come out with some mini icons myself so um keep an eye out on that as i continue to try to grow what i offer in my shop so then last but not least is this like freebie rack so you get this um vellum pocket which i'm gonna put in my a5 hobo i think so i can put stickers in there um and then inside the pocket is this summer doodle sampler and this like lime chartreuse green not chartreuse but like a kiwi green and then you have the two fashion girls like on a vinyl from when SPC uh, did this like I think for Black Lives Matter um, fundraiser and then the pride munchkins super cute I might give this to my friend who is non-binary and then because I already have like two of those now and then I um, have this here the boarding pass terminal um, I don't know what I would use this for but I might de-stash it, we'll see. So that is it for this portion of this haul. I hope you guys had an amazing May and that you're, you know, halfway through June pretty much and you are having an amazing time this summer and I can't wait to be able to film for you guys and talk to you guys and play with all the planner stuff. Um, but until then, I'll talk to you guys later. I love you guys so much. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, turn on the bell for notifications and I'll talk to you guys later. I love you. Bye. <laughs>